I'm in the 80s. You want to turn that off? No, oh, no, sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I won't turn it off. I'm not going to, but thank you. Place it around the other way and do as you're told. No, I'm not out of course. No, you're not. Leave the helmet where it is, mate. Put the helmet down. I'm just wearing it. It's one place, mate. I, I don't understand how you're allowed to record me and I'm not allowed to record you. Welcome back to San Joaquin Audits. On this channel, we look at police interactions and deal with police accountability. Today's video involves an officer overseas in Sydney, Australia, who hates transparency. It is brought to you by the channel It's J Just J. Be sure to give them the credit that they deserve. In this video, not only does this officer break traffic laws to pull this guy over, he doesn't even really give him a reason on why he's being pulled over in the first place. Instead, immediately directs all the attention to the fact that he's being filmed and tries to force him to stop. Why do you think that is? I personally believe it's to try and hide the fact that he's trying to extort this man of his money by giving him bogus tickets. Only he can't because the camera will document it all. Hello mate, how you going? It's not bad. Do you want me to pull over or what? No, yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, it's right. <laughs> what size engine is it? I want to pass. Oh, right, yeah. Okay. What, uh, have you got a license in? Yeah. Ah. Uh, oh, yes, I do. I won't turn it off. Yeah, turn it off. I won't turn it off. Place it around the other way. I'm not going to, but thank you. Place it around the other way and do as you're told. No, I'm allowed to record. No, you're not. Yes, I am. You're allowed to record me and I'm not allowed to record you. How you're allowed to wear a helmet and be impolite, I'm, I'm not allowed to wear a helmet as well. I'm not being impolite, mate. As soon as I stopped you, I was nice as pie. Then when you started recording and moved your helmet and doing all this other stuff, I just that's when I start own, getting the no, annoyed. I'm sure for my own benefit, because I've been pulled over for, for a stupid offence, and I've been given a ticket that didn't even exist. Right, it, just, it didn't exist, it didn't happen just then. So I'm just making sure I don't get a ticket for something that I haven't done. Like, you, you can understand that, right? All I need is for one person to be upset, and then I get a ticket for a yeah, I can't buy. situation, Mark. What's the brand of the boy? The Motover. Don't, don't fill up it, you'll break it. Well, it's not really secure. Yeah, I know, I need to get another one. It, it is secure until you start playing with it. No, it's not. It's not secure. Was it secure when you pulled up? It's not secure. It's only held by one screw. Okay. But was it secure when you pulled up? It's not secure because I can move it. I'm okay. not going to give you a ticket, mate, what? so you can relax. Yeah, all I know. Right? But what I'm saying is... It, all I'm it saying to you is you it's got to be better than that. Otherwise, you're going to drive around it's going to fall off. Okay. And then you're in trouble then. Alright, all I'm saying to you is get another screw, 
Get another screw in there and that solves the problem. Alright. Okay? That's all I'm saying to you. Alright. All I was saying was don't fiddle with it because it will fall. See you later, mate. Have a good one. Alright folks, there you have it. Lastly, I want to give a huge shout out to the user Josh Rhodes for directing me over to a new channel that highlights the current state of policing in this country. That channel goes by the name of Minnesota Reformer. I greatly recommend checking out their videos. When watching their videos, I want you to think about this. Many people ignorantly believe the police protect the public from criminals. But ask yourself this, who's there to protect the public from criminal cops? It's easy for people to be tricked and brainwashed into oppression. With that being said, I hope you all do your own research and educate yourselves.